A mutual affordable housing program for low-income home buyers now paving the way for more houses to be built in Hollister. KIOM's Natalie Gutierrez talked to families who have moved into their new homes and the nonprofit behind it. Families struggling to find housing in Hollister are putting in work <laughs> to build homes of their own. Karina Salazar is helping build hers and says the program couldn't have arrived at a better time. I do feel really uh, grateful and fortunate to have this opportunity given to me. Um, so that's why we do. I do try my hardest to be out here and um, to fulfill this dream. The mutual self-help housing program is an affordable housing construction project backed by federal and local organizations. Those selected work in groups of two and all all homeowners work together on everyone's house. This is a mutual self-help housing program. Um, consists of 24 houses. Uh, CSDC develop the site and then sells the lots to the individual homeowners. Um, and then they're brought in for training to build their own houses. Flores tells me after 18 months of hard work, the first 12 homeowners were able to move into their new homes early this month. And for the second half, they are expected to move in in the next two months. Flores also says no one moves in until the last home is built. Each family is required to work 40 hours a week, something that Oscar Tostado did with his family. Each sacrifice is worth it. You get me? We're here and we accomplished our goal. Flores tells me they had 740 applicants to build one of 24 homes. In Hollister, Natalie Gutierrez, KION News Channel 46. Flores also tells KION similar programs have been used to build over 350 homes in the city of Hollister over the last 20 years.